would like to talk about Jane Melnap and her work. She's a research ecologist at the United States Geological Survey. And I would like to talk not about a specific paper from her, but about her body of work with biological surcrust or biocrust, which are communities dominated by lichens, mosses, and cyanobacteria that live on the soil surface in many ecosystems across the world, but they are particularly dominant in dry land. The work of Jane Belknap has been fundamental to all of us working with biocrust because she has been a, a truly pioneer uh, studying the ecology and the importance of these organisms in natural ecosystems uh, across global drylands and she has studied virtually all aspects of the ecology of, of biocrust right? and her body of work uh, has been highly influential during all my career and was the main motivation why uh, biocrust are a main uh, research line in my lab and was also a major motivation about our idea or the concept of using biocrust as a model system to study multiple questions in community ecology and global chain biology and also in ecosystem ecology, which my lab has been exploring over the years. So she has been, her work has been fundamental, not only for me and for my team, and for all of us that in my lab that we have worked with Biocrass over the years, but to the entire Biocrass and Dryland community. She has been perhaps one of the most influential scientists I live today working in these, in the, with these communities and in these ecosystems.